Hello, we are from BTEC Electronics. We have done mega project in vehicle tracking and locking system. So here is our total components that we have used in this project. This is ARM7 trainer kit we have used and in which we have used LPC2148 as IC. Uh, LPC2148 has 32 KB on chip RAM and 512 KB flash ROM. Then here we have used 16 by 2 LCD for showing various instructions that we need to show. Then here there are two UARTs for this kit. One UART we are using for GSM and another UART we are using for GPS. Then here is the matrix keyboard. Matrix keyboard uh, is 4 by 4 keyboard of, uh, of which we are using only 10 buttons for entering the password. Then uh, here is relay pair of which we are uh, using only one relay for showing dual locking mechanism of the vehicle. Um, this is the PIR sensor which is motion detecting sensor. Uh, the speciality of this sensor is when any obstacle comes in between uh, which is moving obstacle then it immediately detects it because uh, this is IR sensor and uh, so difference in IR levels it detects immediately and it gives indications to uh, LPC2148 kit. Then here we are having GPS module. Uh, GPS module is uh, basically for uh, showing latitude and longitude uh, of the vehicle where vehicle exactly uh, situated is so that uh, we can easily uh, put these latitude longitude values into Google map and get the location. Uh, this is uh, GSM 300A module. Uh, GSM module is for sending message to owner's mobile number and receiving message from owner uh, so that uh, we can easily communicate with owner without having any barrier. Uh, GPS and GSM kits are having no weather barrier or uh, no any problem of temperature, humidity as such. Uh, this is the antenna of the GSM. Uh, antenna uh, uh, is for getting range and uh, GPS antenna is also the patch antenna. Um, GPS uh, antenna needs GPS antenna needs uh, the open uh, open uh, environment to getting range. That's why we have put it put it in out of the window. Uh, so now coming towards the working of our uh, total project. Uh, so this is our overall system, uh, so this is the PIR sensor and uh, PIR sens when uh, someone enters into the vehicle, PIR sensor will get activated and give information to LPC2148 kit. So I am uh, making some motion, so uh, when I uh, make the motion immediately here on LCD vehicle theft anti-locking uh, vehicle theft anti-locking system that comes then enter password uh, the owner has already set some password that thief, uh, thief does not know so I will enter some random password blow it to the child parat karu ka? so I am entering some random password as I don't know the password. So it is showing me that password is wrong. So it is ask, asking me for one more attempt. So as I don't know the password, I will again enter the wrong password. Password is wrong. So uh, now Relay is on. Relay is on means uh, it is showing that uh, doors are locked. So it now it will immediately inform to the owner of the vehicle about the theft of the vehicle. So uh, GSM uh, kit will get activated and message will be shown on this mobile. So message has come from the kit. So I am opening this message.
इट इज शोइंग मी मोशन डिटेक्टेड ओके सो नाउ आई कम टू नो दैट माय व्हीकल इज इन द पार्किंग एंड समवन इज गोइंग टू मेक द रॉबरी ऑफ दैट व्हीकल सो आई कैन इमिजिएटली वॉक टू द पार्किंग एंड सेव माय व्हीकल सो दिस वॉज द वन केस दैट द अनऑथराइज पर्सन डजंट नो द पासवर्ड ऑफ द व्हीकल सो नाउ द सेकेंड केस Uh, in the second case, I am making again some movement and it is showing me for entering the password. Now, uh, though I am an authorized person, I know the password of the vehicle anyhow. So, I am entering the correct password of the vehicle. so it is showing me that password is correct uh, even the password is correct it will give message to the owner that uh, someone has started your vehicle so now uh, my mobile is getting the message message is motion detected Uh, suppose uh, the person entered is the owner then owner will ignore this message but suppose it is unauthorized person then owner will immediately come to know and owner will ring that gsm so that gsm again will get activated gsm has got the ring so now uh, G, uh, gps will uh, get activated and gps will send the locations of latitude and longitude to the owner's mobile via gsm so now uh, message has come about the location of the vehicle Uh, so now mobile is showing me the exact location where my uh, vehicle is situated uh, it is latitude 16 degree 50 minutes and 685 seconds north and longitude is 74 degree 36 minutes and 182 seconds east uh, so i can put this value into google map and get exact location of my vehicle so uh, this was all about our project vehicle tracking and